And Barry, tell us a little bit about how the day starts and progresses for the kids who come here. Yeah, so the kids typically start off with um, a circle time activity. Um, and then we offer um, a teacher-led activity, which um, Jonathan is doing right now with the kids. Um, Jonathan is one of our teachers who's leading um, a literacy-based activity at the table. Um, they typically have a craft activity in their day, um, some time to play in the gym, um, snack time, um, and of course just free play time where they can explore um, this big space that we have here at Pace Kids and all the great resources we have inside of it. Um, and then we end off the day with our goodbye and our songs and yeah. Great. Typical day at Peace Kids. Yeah, typical day, and uh, you have this beautiful new facility now, so there is room for registration. How many kids are you accommodating now? Yeah, so we have about um, approximately 40 kids in our program registered today. Um, we do have uh, space available still. Um, we have we offer in our morning program. It's more of a multidisciplinary program where we address um, all needs of development. Um, so kids might be working communication, gross motor, fine motor. Um, our afternoon program is really tailored for kids with speech and language delays, um, and we have available spots in both programs. In both programs. Yeah, That's and good our news. registration. Yeah. Okay. And so how did how does it work for parents? Do they get an assessment before they come, or here they get the assessment? Yeah, they do. So um, they do get an assessment before they come um, and then we're able to um, register them, provide them with a tour of our brand new facility and get their kids started. Um, if parents um, are needing some help with that assessment piece, they can also give us a call here at Pace and we can um, be of some assistance there as well. Okay, so, fantastic. Yeah. Are you seeing a demand for a facility like this, the expansion? and? Absolutely, yeah, absolutely. Um, we really, um, we knew that the Northeast was an area that really um, needed a school like Pace Kids um, and so we're so happy to be in the community and we've just seen um, an amazing growth this year, just starting in our first year here in the Northeast and look forward to many more years here. So, yeah. yeah. Well, thank you so much for hosting us, and we can see how great the kids are treated here at Pace Kids. Thank you, Barry. It's great to see you as always. A little reading time, a little craft activity, a little Play Doh, little Hungry Hippos there in the corner. Uh, it's been a really fun morning here at Pace Kids. Guys? Hungry, Hungry Hippos. I like that game. Okay. <laughs> Feel better carbo load, speaking of what she's doing tomorrow. Oh, yeah, Jill, you're kickboxing kickboxing but amped up a notch so it's uh kickboxing with resistant bands tomorrow as we'll see how it goes as if kickboxing wasn't hard enough kick hard enough. resistant okay <laughs> we'll see you then or you resist the Sounds kick good. the urge to kick maybe it's that man it's, it's hard anyway right it is tough